if you have set up scan to email with the Gmail account using our PowerPoint from the past on an eStudio 2830, 3530, or 4520 series machine, following these instructions should get the machine up and running. You will need the IP address of the copier that can be found at your copier if you go into the administration settings click on network and ipv4 that's where you can find it on the copier you'll put that into the address bar of internet explorer that brings you to the top access page click on the administration tab admin password is one two three four five six unless you have changed it click login Second button underneath setup says network. And about halfway down, you will see SMTP client. Click on that. And again, SMTP client in the gray box. That will bring up this screen. Leave the top box alone. Second box, enable SSL. We will disable SMTP server address. We will replace with relay dot a p p r i v e r dot com again that is relay r e l a y dot a p p r i v e r dot com so you can see i've done it before in this um, leave the pop before smtp disabled authentication disable the login name and password stays the same and you'll change the port to 2525 Click OK. It will ask you, are you sure? Click OK. Upper left, click on Save. It will warn you that it's the copier will go offline. Click OK again. This screen will come up. It does say a few minutes, but for this adjustment, it usually doesn't take more than 30 seconds. After that, try clicking the Refresh button. I usually go back in, click on Network, SMTP client and double check that the changes have taken place. If they have, go ahead and go to the copier and um, test the scan to email. Thank you very much. Have a great day.